Okay, here we are and welcome to another trike bike video. In this video we're looking at a cargo tricycle with the ice cream unit on the front. These are very very popular for selling drinks and ice creams in the summertime. It can be quite confusing but there are three chargers supplied with this unit. This charger here is for the pedal assist, so the electric ice cream tricycle. This is used to charge the battery on the rear up here and it plugs into this opening here and that'll charge it for when you want to go out riding. The second charger is a more conventional battery charger. Now this plugs into your wall socket and the other end goes into the side of the cabinet down here. You lift up this flap and it goes in there to charge the battery which is inside. Let's just open the cabinet and have a look. In here you can see a 50 amp battery unit and in this case it's plugged into the fridge. Down here where the black plug is this is for when you're out and about on the uh, on the beach selling your products. The third is this third charger is this quite uh, industrial looking switch mode power supply. This gets mounted inside the cabinet. This plug goes into the freezer. The other plug goes into a wall outlet. And you'll use this for continuous 240 volt operation. So if you're um, sighted somewhere where you can plug into 240 mains all day, then this is the best option to use and also to use when the uh, tricycle is uh, being stored but you still want your product frozen. We mount the unit with industrial quality double sided tape. So we just peel that off, Whoop. peel it off when we're ready to go. So the industrial power supply is now uh, connected and if we want to make it a permanent connection we can pull out the socket from the battery here. It's a bit tight down there so sometimes you've got to pull it around and fiddle. We can just put that to one side and then we can roll over the other cable from the switch node power supply and plug it into your fridge. It's now firmly connected and your final step is to put the uh, the floor in and this cable here with the uh, wall outlet can go through the opening in the side here and you can just uh, plug it in with an extension cord. Okay when the floor is put back in you can see the cable running through here when not in use you can just push it back down into the cavity Give it a bit of a wiggle around to get it all the cable down. And it can just uh, stay there like that. And then when you uh, need to plug it in, you can just attach an extension cord to the plug. And um, off you go. Ready for business. We can close the doors. One door and the other door. Sometimes these doors will rattle a little bit as you're riding. So we put a little bit of sponge rubber self-adhesive along the top seam here and that keeps everything nice and quiet while you're riding. 